Hey Stampers, Robin Mudd here with Simple Designs by Robin. And you'll have to excuse my attire because um, this is, sorry, let me adjust the camera. Uh, this is like the fifth time I've done this. The first time I had people coming in and my grandkids came in and then I realized I was in my pajamas when I did the other one. And then yesterday, um, my husband and I were watching it and so I got in a little bit of trouble with him because I accidentally showed my address because, um, I don't guess I'd love to show Gracie's because hers is a post office. But I do have a post office box, and it's post office box 1164, Bardstown, Kentucky, 4004, if you guys want to send me friend mail or something to review. But I was excited to get this from Gracie, and then when my husband and I were watching it, he saw that I had accidentally showed our main address, and so he was a little upset, so... I am out here now at 8 o'clock at night redoing it. So, here we go. One more time. And Gracie, I love you. Gracie's Loft, I love you so much. And her name is Marsha. And if you all haven't subscribed or checked out her channel, please do so. She is about everything Parisian. She loves um, the Eiffel Tower. Um, she's just a very, very sweet lady. And, oh my goodness, she sent me some, oh, I love these flowers. It's some washi tape. Isn't that pretty? Now, I had never bought any of these Scotch Expressions because I have never seen them in the store. But that is so pretty. I especially love this color here. And, oh my goodness, this is so pretty. Now, I have seen these, but they are like uh, edgelings. Uh, and they didn't have any butterflies or anything on them. I'm sorry for the glare. And under here, we have some ribbon. Oh, cupcake ribbon. Isn't that pretty? I don't have a whole lot of birthday stuff because I just really don't do a lot anymore since the kids are grown. I, mean, I send them a card and you know that's about it. And oh, she sent me some really pretty ribbon. That's beautiful. You guys have to excuse my hands, even though I did take a, a bath. Uh, we're redoing our house, as most of you know. And I was in there painting until the last minute, until it got so dark in there, so Mike made me stop. I'm like, why? I can paint in the dark. But he seemed to frown on that. Oh, and this is a little bumblebee. Isn't that cute? I'm going to put that on my journal. Oh... This is so cute. I love this. These are little ladybugs. And I saw my first ladybug the other day at the house on the door. Oh, excuse me. And I was like, here we go. Spring has sprung. Oh, and here's some more bumblebees. This is definitely going in my journal. I love frogs and all kinds of things like that. Turtles. Oh, and this is cute. These are boutique brads. They are so petite, but they are so cute. I love the bees and the ladybugs. They are so cute. And here is something that I was sitting up here that she gave me. She gave me uh, these, this frog. I love frogs. And this side is matte, but this side is real glossy. And it's this way with a little monkey, too. I thought that was really cute. I set those up on my desk over here. And she wrote me a, a really cute note, and it was so sweet, and I'm not going to read it on here. And then she cut out these little doilies. Now, for some reason, I love this color. Who knows, maybe it's because it reminds me of caramel, and you all know I love caramel. And she just had the prettiest colors. There's this one, and this one, and this one. And this one, and this one, and these three, and I love those colors. Are they not beautiful? I bet she has a cricket. Do you have? She may have a cricket, or maybe she just has um, the. Uh, oh, excuse me, the doily um, cutting thing. I need some coffee, you all. I'm, I've been we've been working all day, and I'm not used to that. Um, a die is what I'm trying to think of. 
And look at the cute little squirrels. I love squirrels. That's a little button. It is so cute. That's going to go on my um, planner also. Oh, and this is really cute too. And thank you so much for sharing your Eiffel Tower and your Fleur de Lay. And is that how they say it? Fleur de Lay, Lay, Lay. Fleur de Lay. That's cool. Y'all know it's like my bedtime here because I'm, I'm exhausted. But I wanted to get this back out because I did not want Marsha to think that I was ungrateful. And then I had just taken that off. But, you know, Mike was having like a conniption. So, even though I like to let him think he's the boss, you know, every now and then, I, you know, I'll, I'll let him uh, really think that he is. And this is, uh, this has a little, uh, like a thread that is so cute that will go on my bracelet. I love that. Or if it's a brad, I'll use it for something else, but I can't tell what it is right now. And I don't want to mess it up. But this is beautiful, Marsha. Thank you so much. And then I have some uh, pop-ups. And I had to explain to my granddaughter what these were because she wasn't, oh, excuse me, really sure, excuse me, what they were. You guys are going to think I'm awful, but it's, it's, I don't mean to be rude by yawning, but um, I'm pooped. And, but I do want to get this video up again. And these are beautiful. These are definitely going in uh, my packages on my uh, planner. I love it. She did a really good job picking stuff out. I love it. I love flowers. I cannot grow flowers. But in honor of Joey Feek, um, the country singer that passed away uh, from cancer on March the 4th, um, I am going to endeavor to make a Joey's Garden. And my oldest son, his name is Joey. But I'm going to make that in her honor. And I plan on planting a white rose. And I've already had some, uh, is it Hyacinthias or however you pronounce it. I'm already going to put those out. And I am going to make an endeavor in her honor to finally grow some flowers. Now, I have no green thumbs. But, you know, I'm going to see what I can do just for her. Um, oh, and these are some beautiful butterflies. Look at those. They are beautiful. Thank you so much, Marsha. And then she got me some recipe cards. Um, for those of y'all who heard the video before, you know that my older son's been wanting me to write down recipes. And I just didn't have anything to put them on. And I've been looking for these. But for some reason or another, our store just hasn't got them yet. And then she sent me a really cute, uh, oh, a heart pencil. How pretty. I will definitely put that in my journal also. That way I won't have to try to find something to erase it. But anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this again. And I'm so sorry that you all have had to watch it over again. But after Mike saw that I had put that on there, he kind of had a conniption because I was kind of holding it up, uh, showing the pretty paper that she put on there for me, and I love that paper. Um, it's the real, it's the really nice tape. Maybe it's like a, the duct tape. It really has the really nice feel to it. It's not real thin. But I hope you guys hang in there with me. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. A thumbs down if you don't. But at least tell me why. And for those of you who have seen the video before, I'm so sorry that you had to watch it again. But it was better than having to listen. You, know, you married, you, you ladies who do YouTube, you all know how it is when you're married. and uh, You may say something your husband thinks that you really shouldn't say. But anyway, you know, I like to welcome all my new subscribers. Or I like to call you family. Um, and you have my post office address, so if you guys want to send me anything, you're more than happy to. If you have any questions, get me on my email at simpledesignsbyrobin at gmail.com. And I love you. Check out my friend's channel. Check out Kate is for Karen. Check out Stephanie Johnson. No Guts, No Glory. Um, I think Lisa Halls is the other lady I've been watching, and she is really sweet. And, of course, um... 
uh, Only in My Dreams. Check her out. And Gracie's Loft. I mean, they're the sweetest bunch of women you ever wanted to meet. Oh, yeah. Don't forget Jean Louise and um, Abel Lee. Um, they are the sweetest people. And I'm lucky to call them my friends. So, God bless you. Have an excellent night. And have a wonderful, wonderful weekend.